When I wrote my longevity book, I found a lot of research saying about 0.6 grams of protein per pound of body weight has some longevity benefits, and it was good research. I've also seen a lot of other research saying one gram per pound of body weight is what humans should eat. And there's a group of people who say, well, eat plant-based protein because it doesn't have amino acids in it, even though it's only 30% as effective as yeah, right, right, right. And I've tried both extensively. And I eat one gram per pound of body weight religiously of animal protein. Yeah. I don't count any plant protein I might accidentally eat because most plant protein is trying to kill me. It's not trying to help right. me. Right. So what do you say to people say, but animal protein raises mTOR? So does exercise? Oh, wait, don't carbs raise it way more? Oh, wait, they do. Yeah, right? they do. Yeah, yeah. So does exercise. I've seen some evidence. Yeah, definitely exercise raises mTOR. If you look at the studies uh, in human myotubes, you know, uh, insulin from carbohydrates raises mTOR also. I think that mTOR is not a bad thing. If you've ever seen someone that has deficient mTOR, they just, it doesn't work. You know, if you, too much rapamycin is a horrible thing for humans. You don't want to overdose on rapamycin. Um, so, mTOR is not to be feared. And I think that most of this mTOR fearing has now swung back the other way. And people are realizing like this, probably this whole like metformin craze and maybe the whole rapamycin craze was overdone and we shouldn't be doing that stuff. Don't fear mTOR. If, mTOR is great. If you want muscles, which are associated with longevity, if you want hips and bones that are strong and don't break when you go skiing or you, you know, you pick up your child or you accidentally fall on an icy sidewalk, you want mTOR. You know, if you want to be fertile and have libido, you want mTOR. Right. You know, you think of a human that has low mTOR, they basically look like a pud. You know, they're just like... Like they're, Bill Gates. They're kind of like Bill Gates is kind of the meme for low mTOR. Yeah, they're, they're pretty weak and mushy. And if you want to live a long life like that, you can take it. It's amoeba. Human amoeba hybrid is like low mTOR. So I don't worry about, I don't worry about that at all. I think that, that whole conversation was always frustrating for me. 